When I say let's go on a walk, Jane's really excited. But ever since I've had her, when I take her on walks, it's impossible. When Jane doesn't want to go somewhere, she puts her tail between her legs and she's just paralyzed with fear, it looks like. At some point, she sees like an invisible wall and she doesn't want to cross that wall over and she actually runs back home, really afraid. Then we can maybe get one or two doors down and then she sits down and she's can't get home fast enough and ends up kind of pulling me back home. I go on walks all the time and I have to leave her behind and it just feels so wrong. Okay, so how can I help you guys? I'll start. We have a dog named Jane. She's um, a really sweet, really smart, good dog, but she's afraid to go on walks. I can get her a few doors down the alley and then she turns around and goes home. And I, I went to dog school with her and I dropped out because everything was about walking her and it, I, I didn't get anywhere with that. And then I went back and I, I'm a dog school dropout. Um, Two times? Yeah. What, what do you think makes her fearful? People, noise, if it's a windy day and there's things blowing outside, she won't even go outside some days. She's not nervous or fearful or tense. Let's see, there we go. So there's a little hesitant right there. So I, I put a little bit. I want to see really what, what makes her stop. So far I'm not feeling bad energy and I'm not looking. There we go, bad, that's bad energy. But she recovers quick. There we go, and a little fight right there. There we go, another fight. So pretty much this is the poll that they were saying that she don't pass. Um, look at, <laughs> we keep passing the threshold. There we go. There we go. This is this is as bad as it gets right here. There we go. This is good. See, the owners are back, so she's picking up on the owners. So she becomes powerful, and she's like, hey, if I do this, I don't have to face my fear. There we go. That, this is typical. There we go. That's right. It's how, it's how you deal with it. There we go. Typical. She was doing fantastic. It's how you deal with it, okay? So don't be nervous, don't be no. tense, and not, none of that, we're not hurting her. This is all the typical behavior she does. If we, if we surrender, then she wins. Then the bad behavior wins. There we go. There we go, there we go, there, there we go. So does she have any dog friends? She used to, but they moved there away. Go. That's right, that's right, that's right. You saw it? You saw the fight? So the fight, you know, we adjust, we put the collar in a certain position, you know. Moves forward. So I wanted her to be more connected to the Eskimo side of her. And uh, she said, look, I'm ready. So I gave her what she wanted. Good girl. Good girl. After we removed that invisible barrier, that dog was in heaven. He, she was just floating. She was just doing her thing. She was just it's amazing. being a dog. All right, now we can go for a walk. Good. Awesome. <laughs>